Computer vision uses images and video to understand a real-world scene. It goes beyond image processing, which can remove noise or blur and identify objects based on size, color, or location. Instead, computer vision can also interpret the scene, identifying objects like pedestrians and traffic signs. More specifically, computer vision techniques can identify, track, measure, detect, and classify objects in images and video. Let's see a few of these in action. First, we'll look at how computer vision identifies objects based on motion. This includes very basic techniques like image subtraction or more advanced algorithms like optical flow, taking into account groups of pixels rather than individual pixels. Next, you can see how computer vision is used for object tracking. Examples include point trackers for robust face tracking or multi-object tracking for objects that are obstructed. Camera calibration allows you to remove lens distortion, measure an object's real-world size, or estimate distance from the camera. Next, feature detection, extraction, and matching allows you to find an object in a cluttered scene. Here, I'm able to detect and follow the object around, even if it changes size or orientation. You can use machine learning and deep learning techniques to identify or classify objects in a scene. For example, you can train a model to identify images of french fries or sushi. You can do all of these computer vision techniques in 3D using point cloud processing and stereo vision, which is a growing research area for autonomous vehicles and robotics. The idea involves capturing individual points in space and mapping them to a real world scene. Hopefully you now have a sense of what you can do with computer vision and what the term means. So how do you start? Everything I showed in this video is a MATLAB example that you can try yourself. You can get a free trial and watch videos to help you get started. For more information, check out the links below.